match between the Queensland Bulls and the Tasmanian Tigers. James Hopes won the toss and sent uh, Tasmania in. And he starts well. Good bounce uh, here at North Sydney, as there was. It was like to get on the side. That'll be the first boundary of the morning. I don't think he really intended to play at that, but he's got four. That's a fine shot. Second boundary for Tasmania this morning. Boundary. There's a nice shot. There's a gap. That'll be four. That's what you need to do. Kawaja this time. Oh, he kicked it. And that time he might have got him. That time he finds the gap. So a boundary off the last ball. Takes Tasmania to 89. That's a nice shot. He's got enough on that. That's the beauty of North Sydney Oval. If you're a batter, that is. That's 50 for Dunk off 64 balls and the 100 up as well. None for 102. It has kick-started and now Payne goes over mid-off. And that's his 50. He goes again. Goes well. In semi-final. Has he got enough on it? Oh, I nearly got him. That would have been a superb catch. Joe Burns was the man at mid-off. Getting on top of the bowlers. Goes again in that same area. This time it's flat and hard and one bounce over the rope. It's a good touch, Ben Dunk. He goes again. That'll be six more. That's good hitting from Ben Dunk. Straight back over the bowler's head. Pulled away and pulled away very, very well for six. So Tim Payne really opening his shoulders here. 99. Oh, it's going to be tight if he hits. Very tight, but he's not hitting and it's 100. Ben Dunk, 100. He's second in domestic 50 over cricket. Oh, this is big. Way up onto the bank and dropped. Over mid-off, that'll be four. Payne on 99. That'll do. That's 100 for Tim Payne. Well, that's four. It's not badly bowled from Ben Cutting. He got it full and wide. Ben Dunk got just enough on it. And again, and he's got just enough on that one. Back-to-back -back sixes for Tim Payne. Make it three in a row, and that's probably the best. Oh, no, he's had another opportunity up there. And this one could be out. Reardon's underneath it, he's got him. There's a wicket. A long-awaited one for Queensland. Tim Payne will have to go. Three sixes in the over, and finally he departs for 125. That's 150 for Ben Dunk. He's the first Tasmanian to score 150 in domestic one days. I said, you sure he can't, Sonny? There's enough on it. Yes, it is. Clears Reardon at deep square leg. Another six for Dunk. Races to 157. George Bailey joining the party. On the boundary line, they need to be about another 20 metres back up onto the bank. Oh, hit very well. Flat and straight for six to finish the over. Excellent finish the over. It's one for 331. He's gone again, and it's gone all the way a long way, and we've got someone under it, and he successfully caught it. Well done, sir. Well, there it is. An excellent... Double hundred from Ben Dunk. He turns to complete the two. Well played, young man. Superb innings. Oh, that's big. That's very, very big. 
Oh, yes, well caught. But unfortunately, it was a free hit. LBW appeal and not given, so they'll complete a leg by. Oh, well bowled again to finish off the over, just getting the one. Now this is what's required. Queensland Bulls after this break will need to come out and score just short of 400, 399 at a run rate of 7.98. Wait. And that'll be four. It's Usman Kawaja there. The Queensland opener, so he's away with a boundary. Just gone begging. Now I have mid-off. That'll be four. Kawaja goes aerial and does it nicely. That's up on the roof. Lovely strike from Kawaja. No one at fine leg, and that uh, wouldn't matter anyhow. It's gonna, well, I suppose if he was standing right on the rope, he might have caught it. Four left-handers in that top five. And that'll be four more. That's well played. Fine legs up. Opportunity at the boundary? No, he's cleared it onto the uh, cement. Well, that won't help the cause. Can he'll afford that? And that's back to back 50s for Chris Hartley. Gone aerial. It's got enough on it, just. And go for four. It wasn't all that far from Clive Rose. That'll be 100 for Kawaja. It's an excellent innings. They hit the stumps, but he's well home. That was a classy innings. 14 fours, two sixes, and his fifth domestic one day 100 here, and his third at North Sydney. Now Hartley and Co. to, to play their shots at the other end. Like that. And that's um, only about only one row back and put down. That's why he's a security man and not a player. Change that in one shot. Gee, that's a good shot. Just looking to get through the over there, Golbus. Now up over extra cover. There's a majestic stroke up on the hill. Shoveled away. And it'll go to the boundary too. Bit of improvisation there from Hartley. Now that's a special shot, a very, very special shot. Very few players can elevate it over cover for six. And there it is, the terrific hundred. Hartley joins Kawaja with a hundred. It's been a very good opening partnership and Hartley has batted very, very well. Well, conditions are, are vastly different, aren't they? And that's the 150 for Kawaja as he just pushed that into the open space on the offside. He's going again. Has he got enough? I think it's just going to be enough, or he may have saved the six. Three hours. Bold XE, well, bold XE. Yes, Rainey. A new record. Lasted all the three hours. Bold in. There it is. The end of an excellent innings by Usman Kawaja. Giving himself a little bit of room to open up that offside field. Looking to launch it over extra cover. That's just cleared mid-wicket. And it'll beat the man on the boundary. Nice timing there from Joe Burns. And that's up on the hill is an opportunity.
That's all he needed to do was get a touch on it. They're looking for two. Well, they're taking the risk. That's pretty well run. I think he's home. It was only a short throw, but uh, I think Hartley got home. He's gone. Great piece of, field, piece of fielding by Feckerty on the rope there. And Reardon starts well. Nicely timed drive. Can't just have the batsman dropping the ball and running every ball. Oh, don't worry about running for that. Our cars are out that way. Oh, the... Up over mid on. Well hit. And well over the fence too. Oh, good catch. Really good catch. There it is. That's the winning runs, the winning boundary. Peter Forrest gets his 11 not out. And that's a terrific result for Queensland. They've chased down 398. Well, there you have it. Ben Dunk is the man of the match. You don't often see a guy make 229 in any form of the game, and they lose the game. But in the end, Queensland were just too good. As I said, they chased the runs down with 16 balls to spare. Kawaja was brilliant, as was Hartley.